Hey guys, Rouse here with King Jalapeno. What's up guys? And we are the Regulators, so this is going to be our first mod showcase. We're showcasing the Balkans Weapons mod, which adds medieval weapons. And uh, King Jalapeno is going to be explaining the melee weapons we have here, so go on. Alright, so the crafting recipe is on the left, and the actual item is on the right. So if you need to pause, pause the video for the crafting recipes. So right now we have the Iron Spear and the halberd and in this chest we have the knife and the iron battle axe and in this chest we have the war hammer and the flail and on the last melee weapon we have the katana all right so now on to our ranged weapons so first thing is the musket you need two things like to make this you need the gun stock and the musket barrel and the crafting recipe to make the musket is right there and to make the musket with the bayonet, it's that kind of recipe. To make the musket round, there's a recipe. To make the crossbow, there's a recipe right there. And here is the crossbow bow. There's the poisonous, or the blowgun, I should say. And here are the darts. There's three kinds. There's the poison one, poison two, and the slowness two. There's also the blunderbuss. You need two things to create this also. You need to make another gun stock and a blunderbuss barrel. And it's the same kind of thing as the musket to build it. The blunderbuss shot, or the rounds as I would say, is uh, this, this recipe. And the last weapon we have is a flintlock pistol. There's a crafting recipe, and it takes a musket now. So, next on to miscellaneous weapons, or not miscellaneous, but our throwing weapons. Yeah, so on the right we have the dynamite, and on the left we have the javelin. And right here we have the boomerang, which is one of my favorite throwing weapons. Next to the miscellaneous, we have the fire rod in this chest. It actually uh, burns them when you use it. And we have the cannon right here, one of my favorites. Blows up crap. Awesome. Here's the recipe, and then you just make the cannon uh, ball <laughs> with uh, gravel. And now we have the training dummy, like that. And you can hit it as many times as you want with any weapon and it won't get destroyed. Yeah, it'll only get destroyed by falling or by fire. That's the only thing it'll get destroyed by because it's made out of wood. So now we're going to be testing our melee weapons first. So Yeah, the good part. So the first thing we have is the spear, which you can just pick it back up, but it's way fun and creative. And you have the iron knife which is still fun in creative mode. And the Iron Battle Axe has really fast attack speed and just takes him down, mows him down. And my least favorite melee weapon is the Iron Flail. Uh, I broke that on accident, but whatever. And now we have the Katana with like the fastest attack speed. And my last, but not, last but not least, the Iron Warhammer, which is my favorite, and you'll see why. Just destroys them all. Alright, so let's go to the weapons that you shoot now. So, first I have the musket, so hold, well not hold right click, but right click and hold it, and um, you can shoot it. It has a pretty good attack, so let's go to the crossbow. One of the best, but you can just keep on shooting it. There's this villager stuck. What? Pulling out of his misery. Yeah. Alright. Alright, so. Let's test this out. Crossbow is pretty cool. So, next we have the blowgun. It's the same as the musket to load it, so, uh, now you can poison the villagers and stuff. You can give them. The, you can use each dart. Like, I have a slowness one right here, I'll give them slowness. Yeah, and there's one that makes them hungry. I guess that's for like other players. If you want yeah. To use it. So next we have the blunderbuss. It's like a shotgun, and um, it shoots everywhere. It has like scatter damage or something. And then last but not least, we have the flintlock pistol. It has a pretty good. No, not pretty good. It actually sucks. But yeah. It's a close range weapon. So I guess if you can just have that loaded, and. Just get ready to shoot like mobs. So 
next are miscellaneous uh, one weapon, the fire rod. The, you could just hit people, and, yeah, and it sets them on fire. It's really simple to make too, so it's really good. So now we have all the villagers yeah. on fire. And I'm gonna have my first weapon, the throwing weapon, is the boomerang. It's pretty good. You can hit like multiple targets if you angle it. And the javelin, it's pretty much the same as the spear, but yeah, you can just throw it farther. Oh, and... What? So, yeah, oh, and the last, the last thing, the dynamite. Just take down all the villagers. Except for the babies, so... Next we have the cannon, and you need things to load this. You need gunpowder. And you need the cannonball. So, um, you have to have gunpowder in your inventory to load it. Don't forget that because it would be a pain in the ass if you don't. So, right click on the cannon with the cannonball, it loads it, and then you aim and you fire. Do you want to give this a try? Alright, I don't have nothing. Okay. There you go. It's pretty cool. And, is it loading? Oh, you gotta right click on it with the cannonball. I got it. I'm gonna shoot it in this little pile. There you go. So, thanks for watching our first mod showcase. Um, like if you want more, and thank you. And comment too if you want more, like any other mods we should do. And thank you guys for watching. <laughs>